Hi Taurus, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm going to be doing your reading for November 2017. We will see what comes up. This is a general reading for hundreds and thousands of people. This is for the sun sign and rising sign of Taurus. This may or may not resonate. I have pre-shuffled those four decks, so I'm only going to shuffle until I'm told to stop, which will not be long. All right, so this is for the sign of Taurus. Just gonna make sure this is zoomed in very good. All right, the basis of your reading is the Nine of Pentacles. So I think many of you are feeling very grateful this month for all that you have. You are just feeling very secure and stable and at ease. You know, it feels like it's going to be a, a good month, all right, already. There's a lot of cups here. There's a lot of love as well, whether it's for yourself, for your family, for, for another person. There's a lot of love here this month and happiness, contentment, bliss. For many of you, it will be a new love, okay? A new love could enter your life if you are single. Could be somebody from your past, okay? Somebody that you knew a very long time ago. Like when you were a child, maybe somebody that you were date that you dated um, a long time ago, or it could be even somebody from a past life. But it does look like you know there could be a, a like a reunite, you know, like where you guys reunite and see each other again and fall back in love. Okay, really seriously, it's like uh, two souls coming back together. All right, it absolutely is. Um, <laughs> it's really good. It, in, anyhow, I feel like um, there's going to be a lot of attraction. There is romance and sexual attraction. So it's going to be very, it looks like a very, very good month. Now, I think I already said this may not resonate twice. I'm going to say it again because this looks too good to be true, all right? And so that's exactly how you are going to be feeling. This looks too good to be true. Um, there's, you're just going to be, uh, be offered a lot of emotional support, okay? All right? You are. I mean, we have the Nine of Cups. We have the Knight of Cups. We have the Two of Cups. We have the Ace of Cups, we have the Six of Cups, we had this is the Seven of Cups and the Eight of Cups. I don't know where all these cups came from, but um, I've used this deck several times, so there's no way that it wasn't shuffled. So there, I mean, I'm telling you what, love is coming this month. If you are already in a relationship, then there should you should like have a, a renewal, okay, of your for, of your current relationship, like a a new splurge, a new welling of emotion, okay, from you or from the other person, or or both. I mean, you both could be feeling like very lovey dovey, okay. So if um, if you are single, you know, perhaps there is going to be a reconciliation case. Okay? So maybe somebody left, and they want to come back, or you want them to come back, and this could be somebody from a very long time ago, okay. Um, it looks absolutely beautiful. Could shake up your independence if you're single because, you know, you could one could become two. Um, it looks like your intuition is very high this month. You are probably ascending to another level. Many of you um, vibrating very, very high. Okay, there are no secrets to be had because you are uh, very intuitive. Okay, you know what's going on. I think that you are very grounded. Um, wow, I just can't believe the energy is so exciting. It looks like a 
unbelievable month with and you know in parentheses unbelievable i believe that it will be like this is not true I, this is no there's no way this could be right you know where did this come from all right and you're going to just be feeling like oh, wow you know that's how it's going to be but with the seven of cups here you are going to have to be careful all right so if you are stuck if you're in a situation right now you might need to um i see a change in perspective okay you're you're gonna have to make a choice it has to do with your independence okay it has to do with you're comfortable right now okay you're very comfortable very comfortable so this is a change so when the seven of cups comes out it says be careful about your choice because it's a big change all right it's a change it's a different focus all right and i think that's what it, that's what this month is it's totally different than the last three months where all of a sudden we got all this love that we have not had for the last three months okay so i feel like that's where you need to be careful because you don't want to be too impulsive all right um, try not to jump make sure you think before you jump you know and that's what I got to say about that because I can see that the uh, there's gonna you're gonna have to make a choice about something could be two people okay if you that's that's what it is and I've been trying to that's exactly what it is okay so many of you might be in a relationship or committed or thinking about maybe your head is committed to somebody else but you aren't with them you know what I'm saying or you could already be with them and um, all of a sudden this person shows up from your past and uh, there's sparks okay there's sparks this is this may or may not resonate there's sparks and now you have this other emotional connection that you might have to walk away from because of this new love all right because this is a choice left or right which one do you want and this is the choices that you need to make be careful think think really hard before you make your choice okay if it was me huh, who would I go with I don't know but that's what you're gonna be faced with what I just said to you all right, and there is a choice. There is no doubt about it, and I think it's between two people. Two, two, two. Okay, all right. So one could be a water sign, and one could be a fire sign. Uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. We do have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo here as well, but I think that's probably you. But it could be the other person. So I think that there is going to be a choice. I think there's all of a sudden somebody is going to show up out of the blue and if it's not somebody you know it could be somebody from a past life but i think it's somebody from the past 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 okay and you're gonna have to you make a choice okay this is for singles i mean it could be for couples too by the sounds of it um and now it doesn't have to be a lover it can be a family member somebody that comes in and changes your life you know that needs to move in all of a sudden you know what I mean but in many 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 cases like what I see right now probably 90 percent of the people watching this it is a love interest okay I'm gonna get the next deck I think wish fulfillment is right around the corner. I think something you have been waiting for regarding love, I do, regarding love is right around the corner. And it leads to a very, like the ultimate happiness that feels like it is too good to be true. You are going to feel at ease. You're going to feel at peace with this person. You're going to feel like they complete you <laughs> too good to be true huh yeah exactly 
can't say I believe it. I'm a Taurus. That's what the cards tell me. So I'm like having a hard time believing this myself. I'm like, holy shit, there's no way. There's no way. So we'll see what happens. Anyway, the Wheel of Fortune. This right here is, oh God, when the wheel finally spins in your favor. Okay. I'm going to get the rest of the cards. Karma. Oh, somebody from the past again. We have that twice. Yep. So somebody from your past may be coming back into your life. Okay. And it's almost like you probably saw this coming or you felt it or you thought about this person recently. Okay. So it's kind of like a, you knew this was coming. Kind of. You sensed it. You knew this change was coming. Major life changes. Fives. Major life changes. Life choices. Okay, that's what I meant to say. Major life choices. All right. Um, expect the unexpected with fives. Expect, uh, seriously, this is going to be very unexpected. The justice card, that's about doing the right thing for you. Being honest. It's also a karma card. Um, it's about um, decisions as well. Decisions. So, oh yeah, you got some major choices. You got at least one choice this month. A big one between two people. For many, 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 many of you. Could be a lover and a child, you know, a lover or and a family member too. It could be. But for many of you, I think it's between two potential partners. And you are going to be conflicted about it. But there's going to be an overwhelming amount of love. Because uh, like all of the cups. You know, there's going to be so much feeling of love. You know, and attraction. Good luck with that. Wish fulfillment's right around the corner. Is this what you've been wishing for, Taurus? Have you been manifesting it? Because, uh, yeah, wish fulfillment's right around the corner and happiness is the outcome. After a time of diversity, not diversity, adversity, I'm sorry, adversity. <laughs> diversity, that's funny. Awesome. Page of Wands, excitement. Oh, that choice again. Damn it, you're not going to be able to ignore it. The, the feeling of emotions, the feeling of love is going to be strong. You, can't, you aren't going to be able to ignore it. You're not. <sighs> yeah, that's the basis of your reading too, Nine of Pentacles. Four of Swords, Seven of Cups, Knight of Cups. Do you dare to do this? Oh my God. This is act on your hunches. When you have to make this decision, which you're going to have to make, okay? There's no doubt about it. It is going to affect your your what's going on in your life right now. If you're single, it's going to affect your independence. And, and it's going to affect your... Um, you know what this is anyway we have intuition right underneath it you know exactly what this is it's going to affect your uh, home you know what I mean it's going to affect your home life it is whatever this choice is it's going to affect your home um, and your heart it's going to affect your heart more than anything 
Anyway, you're definitely going to have to make some choices with the, all these twos and the seven. The seven right here, seven of cups, you have that one twice now. Be careful what you choose because what you own owns you. So do you want to be where you're at right now or where you were? Would you Do you want to be this person or do you want to take another path? Do you want to take another road? That's what your choice is. Are you ready for a change? These twos are about change. These fives are expect the unexpected. Sevens are about faith. You have to have faith. Okay, and you're going to probably feel like you're really going to need time to think about all this. Okay, all of a sudden you're going to get this excitement and you're going to feel this overwhelming feeling of, oh my God, what the hell is this? Wow. You're going to feel like, wow, what is this? Oh my God, how did this happen? You know, and it's going to be even, it will probably be so exciting that you're going to need a break. Okay, you are going to need a break. You're going to need to take some time out, a time out, to go within and focus to do the right thing for you. Because you had this a big decision. A big, big decision in November 2017 is coming up. A big one. And so you are going to need time to be by yourself, to figure out what is the best decision, what is the best choice for you, which is the justice card for me, what's the best choice regarding love, which is the Knight of Cups. And there may be a little tension because of this choice, but you are going to figure it out. The Seven of Cups says, you know, which one do you want? What is it that you want? Really think twice because what you own owns you. Really, really, really think like 10 times, which you're going to. Whew. So November is about decisions because I think that a new love or a new welling of emotion is going to come into your life out of the blue for many, 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 many of you. And if it, you know you love a child almost or as much or more than your partner, everybody's different. Okay, so this could be a child and it causes a problem between you and your current partner and you might have to choose or it's a love interest. Okay, I think for the majority of the majority of the people watching this, it is a love interest that you perhaps have, you know, thought about here or there, here a time ago, you know, you were with them or thought about them or whatever. It could even be somebody from a past life. Maybe they've crossed your mind a time or two and all of a sudden they show up back in your life. And this could be for couples or for singles. And you are going to have to make a choice that is going to change everything. Or not. It's up to you. It's up to your choice. But I see that happiness is right around the corner. So I, And I see a lot of change. Twos are about change. And fives are about major life choices. Change choices. Yes. So I think many of you are going to be making some big changes. Okay. But you're going to be happy because the amount of love that you're going to be receiving is going to be exuberant. Okay. Like too good to be true. Daydream. That's what it sounds like, doesn't it? Sure the heck does. I'm going to zoom that in. And I'm going to read it to you. Daydream. You will more easily hear and receive our message if you... I'm going to start over. <laughs> Daydream. You will more easily hear and receive our messages if you daydream regularly. Relax and open your mind to receiving without directing your thoughts. Just notice any feelings, visions, or ideas as if you were watching a movie. This is the sea of creativity. Daydream. Interesting. So Taurus, that's what I have for November 2017. I know we will all pray. 
that this, you know, happens if we're single, you know, um, I don't know. I, I mean, that's, this is what I see. I can't wait to see what plays out. Now, energy and time is fluid. So this could be happening now or this could be happening later. Okay? Right around November 2017. And this may or may not resonate for everybody. For some people, it will. For some people, it won't. If it doesn't, you can check your uh, rising sign. Talk to you later.